Good evening and welcome to St. Mark's Episcopal Church and our Celtic Evening Prayer Service on this Wednesday, July the 29th, 2020. I'm here recording in the gardens of Hills and Dales uh, here underneath the arbor with the greenhouse behind me. Uh, just to orient yourself and remember this place that many of you have likely been to before. Uh, this evening following the service, we have our St. Mark's Social Hour, so please do plan on tuning in for that and be part of that service. Um, be part of that, uh, that opportunity to connect with people that you miss and care about. Um, the link for that was sent out with the email with the service, so you can click not only the link for this, but just like you did that, you can click the Zoom link to open up Zoom in uh, your computer or the app itself to participate in that St. Mark's Social Hour. We start about 5.45 after the service is done, and it's over with by 6.30. We begin. Light and peace in Jesus Christ our Lord. Send us, O Lord, the light of your truth. Dispel the darkness of sin and ignorance. Let us confess our sins against God and God's children. We are the people who helped make the wood on which you were crucified, and still we misuse your creation. We are the people who helped make the nails that pierced your body, and still we hurt those around us. We are the people who did nothing to stop your betrayers, and still we are ruled by comfort or cowardice. Forgive us, Lord. Forgive us. Almighty God, have mercy on us. Forgive us all our sins through our Savior, Jesus Christ. Strengthen our bodies, minds, and spirits, and keep us close to the heart of God. The light of Christ has come into the world. The light of Christ has come into the world. Kindle in our hearts, O God, the flame of love, which never ceases, that it may burn in us, giving light to others. O gracious light, pure brightness of the ever-living Father in heaven, O Jesus Christ, most holy and blessed. Now, as we come to the setting of the sun, and our eyes behold the vesper light, we sing your praises, O God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. You are worthy at all times to be praised by happy voices, O Son of God, O giver of life, and to be glorified through all the worlds. Our first reading is from the book of Ruth. Boaz said to his servant, who was in charge of the reapers, To whom does this young woman belong? The servant, who was in charge of the reapers, answered, She is the Moabite who came back with Naomi from the country of Moab. She said, Please let me glean and gather among the sheaves before the reapers. So she came, and has been on her feet from early this morning until now, without resting even for a moment. Then Boaz said to Ruth, Now listen, my daughter, do not go to glean in another field or leave this one. But keep, but keep close to my young women. Keep your eyes on the field that is being reaped and follow behind them. I have ordered the young men not to bother you. If you get thirsty, go to the vessels and drink from what the young men have drawn. Then she fell prostrate with her face to the ground and said to him, Why have I found favor in your sight, 
that you should take notice of me when I am a foreigner. But Boaz answered her, All that you have done for your mother-in-law since the death of your husband has been fully told me, and how you left your father and mother and your native land and came to a people you did not know before. May the Lord reward you for your deeds, and may you have a full reward from the Lord, the God of Israel, under whose wings you have come for refuge. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. We continue with our first anthem. The soles of his feet have reached the earth, the soles of the Son of Glory. The sun on the housetops shines for him, the voice of the winds with the sounds of the streets announce to us that God has opened a door, the door of hope, the door of joy. Our second reading is from the book of Romans. Let love be genuine, hate what is evil, hold fast to what is good, Love one another with mutual affection. Outdo one another in showing honor. Do not lag in zeal, be ardent in spirit. Serve the Lord. Rejoice in hope. Be patient in suffering. Persevere in prayer. Contribute to the needs of the saints. Extend hospitality to strangers. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Our second anthem is a song of Ezekiel. Let us say it together. I will take you from among all nations and gather you from all lands to bring you home. I will sprinkle clean water upon you and purify you from false gods and uncleanness. A new heart I will give you and a new spirit put within you. I will take the stone heart from your chest and give you a heart of flesh. I will help you walk in my laws and cherish my commandments and do them. You shall be my people and I will be your God. The Lord be with you and also with you. As beloved children of God, let us pray in the words our Savior taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Generous God, whose son Jesus Christ enjoyed the friendship and hospitality of Mary, Martha, and Lazarus of Bethany, open our hearts to love you, our ears to hear you, and our hands to welcome and serve you and others. Through Jesus Christ, our risen Lord, who with you and the Holy Spirit lives and reigns, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Into your hands, O Lord, we place our families and our neighbors, our brothers and sisters in Christ, and all whom we have met today. Enfold them in your will. Into your hands, O Lord. Into your hands, O Lord, we place all who are victims of prejudice, oppression, or neglect, the frail and the unwanted. Cherish them in your love. Into your hands, O Lord. Into your hands, O Lord, we place all who are restless, sick, or prey to the powers of evil, especially those fighting COVID-19. Keep them in your care. Into your hands, O Lord. Circle us, Lord, keep darkness out, keep light within. Keep darkness out, keep light within. Keep fear out, keep peace within. Keep fear out, keep peace within. Keep hatred out, keep love within. Keep hatred out, keep love within. Lighten our darkness, O Lord, we pray, and in your great mercy defend us from all dangers and perils of this night. For the love of your blessed Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. The Almighty and merciful Trinity encircle us, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. The stillness of God be ours this night, that we may sleep in peace. The awareness of the angels be ours this night, that we may be alert to unseen mysteries. The company of the saints be ours this night, that we dream of the river of love. The light of Christ be ours this night, that we may be truly alive to the morning, that we may be truly alive. 
Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all, now and forever. Amen. Have a good night, blessings, and I'll see you at St. Mark's Social Hour. Don't forget to join me and your church friends for St. Mark's Social Hour up next. We'll come together as a large group for a few minutes before breaking into small groups for better discussion and conversation. We'll begin as soon as the postlude for this service comes to a close. You'll find information about how to join in the email that went out at 1 o'clock today or last Thursday's eLion. We don't post information about access on Facebook or YouTube for security's sake. After clicking the link, you'll find yourself in the waiting room, and the host will admit you, and I'll offer some further instructions. You're welcome to join us for just the large group or stay for the whole time. We'll wrap up by 6.30. Zoom works best if you download the app to your smartphone or computer, but you can simply click the link, and it will open a web browser. I look forward to seeing you there. Mm -hmm.